The problems that the nation faces are complex. We need science more than ever. Here at Brookhaven National Laboratory, we are looking into little corners of the universe you can only look into at a facility like this. We are trailblazing the future. The mysteries of matter itself are being solved here at Brookhaven National Lab. 5,000 acres, 300 buildings. About 3,000 people work here at this facility. It's about a $600 million annual budget. We have three to 4,000 people who come in each year to use these facilities we make available for free. The phenomenal scientists that are here enable us to solve problems that otherwise could not be solved. We've drawn amazing people from around the world. Science is exciting. Brookhaven National Lab is managed for the Department of Energy by Brookhaven Science Associates, a partnership between Stony Brook University and Battelle Memorial Institute. Ultimately, the science and technology that we do here have impacts on the economy. What looks like fundamental science is also producing the insights and the ability and applications to do new things for society. The beauty of this public-private partnership is that it helps us to overcome that area between a new invention and commercialization of that invention. A lot of fundamental research has to be done before something can actually transition into a product. Here, we can solve some of these initial questions that make or break a future technology. We are helping other people to really go to the frontiers of science. We're trying to solve why your cell phone battery dies after a few years. We're interested in new drugs. All these problems that require science and cutting edge science to answer them. Here at the Relativistic Heavy Ion Collider, it's the only facility like this in the United States and allows us to recreate conditions just like what occurred in the Big Bang. For the good of humanity, we do studies like this to try to understand the way the universe works at that fundamental level. If we understand these quantum materials, we have the potential to revolutionize energy. We have to maintain our scientific leadership, and Brookhaven's proud to be doing that by delivering the world's best facilities and for hosting the experts who are going to be leading in those critical areas for our future. We have scientists here investigating creation of new materials. It sounds like science fiction, but it's not. Our job is to help expand countries' energy options. Plants are the future. We're trying to manipulate plants to make more sustainable energy. A synchrotron light source is essentially a very large X-ray machine. To give you a sense of scale, you could fit Yankee Stadium inside this ring. We focus the beam down to about 30 gold atoms. That's a world record. There's no other working microscope that can deliver that. Batteries are going to be a huge part of the economy moving forward. We're looking for next generation batteries. How can we make them more environmentally friendly and lower cost? The whole world will benefit. The NASA Space Radiation Laboratory is meant to study the effects of radiation so that we can design better shields for astronauts. We also have an isotope production program. We manufacture the radioisotopes that protect people from cancers in the future and can treat the people that have cancers today. Data intensive computing is really fundamental. Scientists produce more data than they can analyze. We develop new algorithms and tell them where interesting things are happening. We are helping people to make the discoveries of the future here at Brookhaven National Lab. We're becoming a technical society. We need a technical workforce. We need to inspire a new generation. The inclusive environment will allow us to become ever more diverse. This pipeline of students who are fascinated by science, that's part of the joy of this place. That's part of what we do. There have been seven Nobel Prizes at Brookhaven. That passion for discovery is what drives scientists. It's what makes it fun. It's why we do it. The caliber of the people who work here are the best. They come from across science and support. And every time that this laboratory does something great that has impact, all of us share in that. We're in business to enable other people's research. They come because we have the greatest machine and the greatest scientists to work with, and they can do their research in ways they could not do anywhere else in the world. In the early days when I was a scientist, it was discovering things that no one else had seen before. That's a really cool feeling, and the confidence that someday it's going to have an impact. Other people are going to build on it, and it's going to help make the world a better place.